In a show full of zombies rising from beyond the grave, it might not be that hard to fathom a key character being able to do the same in season 2. Audiences are questioning whether a key character really is dead and all of us are dead, here's how they could still survive. The hit new South Korean high school drama meets zombie apocalypse series streams on Netflix and has captured the attention of audiences with a large roster of characters it isn't afraid to kill. The show exaggerates the feeling of being a teenager in an unstable and changing world by juxtaposing normal high school issues like first loves and bullies with an endless horde of mindless flesh-eating undead monsters. In the penultimate episode of the first season, heartthrob Lee Cheong san is bitten by his zombified former classmate, Gwai Nam. Knowing he is doomed, Cheong san sacrifices himself to save his friends, drawing a pack of zombies away from them before the South Korean military drops a bomb on the horde. Cheong San's sacrifice is successful, and his friends escape to safety, from the bomb at least zombies are still very much a problem. When the dust settles after the explosion, Lee Cheong San can be seen lying among the dead zombies. At a glance, it seems pretty cut and dry that Cheong San has sadly been killed by the explosion as well. However, devoted viewers of Netflix K-dramas know by now that things are never quite so simple. Lee Cheong san has had close brushes with death several times in previous episodes, and his survival was not always revealed until the next episode. <laughs> Cheong san does not appear in the season 1 finale episode that follows his apparent death, but it is not far out of the realm of possibility that Cheong san may appear in future seasons of All of Us Are Dead. Fans of Cheong san should hold out hope. It would be a relief for fans to see Cheong san defy death in season 2. The shot of on Joe's dog tag near Cheong San's body after the explosion was a solemn reminder of the love Cheong San felt for her since they were children together. <laughs> Cheong San may deserve another chance to prove himself to her. Beyond that, Cheong San has built up a rivalry with the superhuman half zombie Gwai Nam. Their final fight was interrupted by the bombing that seemingly killed them both. Perhaps a rematch could be in order. Lee Cheong San's death could have been more confidently confirmed, but the fact that it wasn't, combined with Cheong San's history of surviving the impossible, makes it too early to rule out his return in a future season of All of Us Are Dead. Netflix has another hit K drama on its hands, and season 2 is all but guaranteed at this point. The answers will have to wait until then. But what is certain already is that there will be plenty of viewers tuning in to find out when the time comes.